Okay, for once I have a different video on my Lego City Coast Guard boat. I love this set. It, it's very, uh, the playability is definitely a nine and a half. Um, this helicopter, it's a really cool design. It has a crane that drops down from it. If you spin this thing, crane drops down pretty far. I'm not going to do it all the way because it took me 30 minutes to unravel it. And if you see these two grooves in the helicopter, one right there and one right there, see these two little lips? I put that in there and it holds on fairly well. And if you look in the back, the submarine thing, you clip onto it, you put it out in the water, drops it in the water, and it comes off. Now this is a pretty cool design to one of these. The arms move. It takes too long to get those set up. And I thought it was funny. The engines could tilt, so you could obviously make it a heliplane. Then they can tilt like this, and then make it get kind of forward. But that's cool. I thought I could use this for like a little plane. That sort of thing. But then, after you drop it, these things go back and tilt. And whenever you need it again, this thing will drive back up behind it. Back up behind it. This will grab onto it. And it will load it back in the ship. And the ship will just drive off. Now, if you open this up, there's room to put the two pilots. See, I got one right here and one over there. Overall, I'd give this set about a 10. Oh, and this had bumpers. And it came with this boat, but there's not much to do with that boat. And it, it actually floats in water. I would not really recommend doing it, though, because the water always waves up inside of it. So, yeah, overall, I definitely give this set about nine and a half. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Bye.